Hi everyone, Diane at the library. Today I have something special to talk to you about because the election is coming up on Tuesday, March 8th. Our annual candidate information booklet is published. It's available at the library, um, especially if you didn't make it to candidate tonight on the 22nd. Um, it's available at the library on paper. It's available at the town clerk's office. And you can always check out our website at goffstownlibrary.com where you can see the exact information digitally so you don't even have to read it on paper. If you have questions give us a call at the library 603-497-2102. Bye. Hi this is Patty Pennick, Head of Youth Services at the Goffstown Public Library. When you think about the library you probably think about things like books. Um, Maybe you even think about DVDs or audiobooks or music CDs, and you would be absolutely correct because we have all of those things and more. But one thing you might not realize that we have down in the children's room are something called early literacy bag kits, and I wanted to share one of them with you today. It is our ABC literacy kit. So you can check out this item and bring it home to your family and keep it there for three weeks. Inside the kit um, are board books that deal with whatever the topic, the subject matter of the particular kit that you're checking out, as well as an item to play with. So in this case we have a fun little hippo puppet. Hello Mr. Hippo which is always fun to play with your child. Four board books and some cool touch and learn picture cards which are great for vocabulary as well as some sensory and tactile experiences for your child. So again, these are available for checkout. This is the ABC kit. We also have a number, one, two, three kit as well as taking care of myself. So stop into the library and check them out. Hi everyone, this is Stacy, the Teen Services Library Assistant, and I am here to ask you a question. All right, teens, so what would you do if you saw a teacher yelling at one of your classmates uh, for wearing a tank top? Would you react differently, you think, if you noticed that some people that wore tank tops didn't get in trouble while others did? Well, in the story, Dress Coded by Carrie Firestone, we explore that type of a topic. So Molly is an eighth grader who witnesses that happening and she decides to take to making a podcast to discuss about the unfair way that the administration is dealing with dress code enforcement. Soon others start telling their stories about what's going on and they band together to make a difference. This book is uh, something that we're doing for a teen book discussion on Saturday, March 19th at 11 a.m. and it is open to uh, patrons grades 4 through 12. Visit the circulation desk if you are interested in participating. We have books available. So and then come along and we can talk about things you liked, maybe those things that you didn't, um, but also how you can make a difference and how young people can make a difference in their schools. So this event is part of the Community Conversations series. And if you'd like to know more about that, check out the library's website, gosstownlibrary.com forward slash community conversations. One of the great things of working in a library is when there's something that puzzles me or that I don't know anything about and I want to know more about, I know I'm right in the center of where I can find out more. I don't know very much about the Ukraine. I had a school chum who was from there and I know that they make beautiful decorated eggs at Easter. I'm hoping by the time you see this it'll be a moot point. But if you want to learn more about Ukraine, come to the library and talk to one of our librarians. Just because we don't have books on our shelves doesn't mean that we can't get them for you from one of the 13 libraries in our G Milks consortium. There are books about the Ukraine and about this fellow who is part of the problems today in the Ukraine. Come to the Gosstown Public Library, see me, Elizabeth, on the third floor, and I'll give you a tip. If you want to learn quickly about something like a country like the Ukraine, go to the children's section. In the nonfiction section of the children's department, there are all sorts of books that'll get you very quickly up to speed with facts, figures, and photos. Thanks.